project, we're going to do another log birdhouse, but we're going to do something a little bit different. Uh, these are the logs that we cut, we cut last summer. And what we did is we let them sit here for six, seven months. Now, instead of keeping the bark on, we're going to peel the bark off of these to give us a different look. So as we strip this bark, okay, it's, it's going to give us a little different look. It's going to give us a cleaner look versus the other two projects we did and the second one. First one, we kept the bark on. This one, we're just going to take the bark off, get a different look, uh, get a different style. Let's go do some cutting. What we did is we actually cut two thin pieces off and what we're going to do is we're going to use these for our tops and our bottoms. So now all we'll have to do is take the body and Now that we have them cut in half, now what we got to do is we got to gut the inside. Now, when you're gutting the inside, you have a couple choices. Um, one, you could take uh, the chainsaw and kind of uh, align it and gut it out. Two, you can take the chisel, just chisel it out. Three, going to get a, bit, a little bit more fancy, you can take your table saw and cut it at an angle and get a nice round fit. Or four, you can take your table saw, slice it, and then chisel it out. Your choice in how you want to do it. Um, bottom line is, let's go gut it out. I'm going to use the chainsaw because I have it right here. So now we've got, gutted them, we've taken the chainsaw, we gutted them out, and then we took the chisel, chiseled them out. So now we're ready to start aligning them and start putting them together. So we're going to have a pretty good size hole there. That's going to be a good uh, size birdhouse. And now we're going to put them together. Because of the saw blade, they, they aren't as tight as you might want. If you want to hit it up, you might take a little Dremel and Let's get the look. You know, that's not too bad. The side. That looks good. So let's now, let's screw them together. Once I have what I feel is a pretty good lineup, I'm just going to shoot me a couple nails just to hold it so I can secure it better. So I put a couple nails in just to give us uh, a base. As you can see, it's not perfect. You're going to have the uh, saw lines in there, 
but you know what? It's a birdhouse. It should be in good shape. So now I'm gonna clean up these nails and, and put in some, a little bit more solid screws, just a couple. All right, so we've got our tops and our bottoms that we will eventually match up and screw on. But right now, I want to look at it and find out what would be the best side for the hole. And I'm thinking this side is good. We got the big bump here. Um, so we're just going to put the hole right here. So we have an inch and a half wood bit and we're going to try to find good area. As we get ready to line up, now we're going to get ready to put the tops and the bottoms on. Now, we do have to remember when we were cutting these, we lost a half an inch because of the saw. Therefore, they're going to be sticking out. So what we want to do is we want to just make the front look good. So we're going to line that up like that. I'm going to use the thicker piece for the top. It's going to give it more resistance for the winter and the rain. And I have that slight uh, turn or the slight cut on it so it will resist the rain and it'll run off. I'm liking that as a top and a bottom. And um, we're going to screw them on and finish it up. Now we do want to use screws at the bottom so that we can come back and clean them out. So here we end up with our final project. Uh, I kind of like it. It's a little different look of, of the log when it uh, has the uh, bark on it versus remember when we did this one or even the look on this one. This is just a, another look, another project that I'm going to like. If you want, you could clean this stuff up. Um, but it's a birdhouse. It's going to be outside. We're going to like this. Uh, we're going to go mount this now. But I hope you enjoyed this video. hope you learned something. Thanks for watching. I'm Ken Deiniger. Just another backyard project. Let's go hang this. Let's go find a place to hang this.